Well, hi everyone, Sean Humphreys here. Welcome to All Things Retirement. Well, in this installment, we're gonna talk about an important assumption you need to make in your retirement income plan. That's your assumption around life expectancy or longevity. How long will you live through your retirement years? Now, one approach you can take in this very important topic is to just you know over, over promise and maybe you'll under deliver. In other words, run the numbers out to age 100 or 95, that probably is gonna make it uh, relatively bulletproof in terms of your long-term planning. But another approach is to use some of the calculators that are available online to kind of narrow in some of the um, expectancy tables based on your health, your current age, activity levels, that kind of thing. So we're going to share with you a calculator that you might find really helpful. Now if you're new to our channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button. We post content all the time on various aspects of retirement planning and overall wealth planning. So if you don't want to miss future content, be sure to hit the subscribe button. And if you like this video, be sure to hit like. Now I'm going to take you to a, a web page and the page is run by Sun Life of Canada and they have a, a number of calculators. So let's take a look at the page. So if you go to the page, it's uh, sunlife.ca forward slash en forward slash tools. I'll actually have the full uh, link here to this page in the show notes for this video. So go to the show notes, you'll see the link, and it'll take you directly to the calculator page. So let's go through the calculator. So what is your life expectancy? Use this calculator to estimate how long you might live and to see what you can do to live longer, healthier life now and in retirement. So take a couple of minutes to go through the calculator. So we'll go through it, and not all of this data is me, but you can go through and enter it. So you've got a mail, um, I put in age 60, I put in retirement age of 65 in this example, height 5 foot 9, and weight 170. Of course, it's all lean muscle mass and fitness. Uh, just kidding. And if you go through the rest of the uh, questions here, you can see lifestyle questions. Do you smoke? Uh, I've never smoked. How often do you drink? A few drinks per week. Are you active? And it gives you various options, inactive, moderate, and active. Uh, how healthy is your diet? I put in moderate, it's pretty healthy, but I use moderate in this option. How stressed are you? I'm saying low stress, but it varies, right? Sometimes you're really stressed. For some reason, they don't have a moderate stress level, which is kind of interesting. So I put in low. Now you go through, you enter that, and then you calculate your results. And it gives you a really nice little uh, page here that summarizes the results for you. So this page goes, based on what you told us, you can expect to live to age 85. And so you can take that number and use it to uh, you know, help you with some of your forecasting in terms of how long your retirement capital needs to last. Um, do you know that many Canadians are now at living life expectancy? Right? So they, they talk about this. They said, based on my answers, I'm living about two years uh, longer than the average person. Um, it goes through some basic recommendations and some planning tips as well. Now, you're not gonna base all your planning around one little calculator, but it's gonna give you a starting point. So you might say, well, um, I need to make sure that I'm funding retirement at least to life expectancy, which in this calculator is age 85, uh, but I need to be also prepared uh, to fund a longer life expectancy. If you have a partner, and if both of you are healthy at age 65, there's actually a, a very good chance that, you know, probably close to 40% chance that one of you will still be living well into your mid 90s. So when you look at the calculations, you wanna look at various uh, scenarios. One might be two life expectancy, and another might be two, what happens if we live longer than average life expectancy? How do we bulletproof our planning? But I thought I'd show this calculator for you. It's a handy little uh, piece to get you thinking with some tips. Uh, you can save it to your computer. You can print off the information as well and um, take a look at it. Go to the link and it'll take you directly to the calculator. Now, again, if you're new to our channel and you want to get future content, alerts about the content, make sure you hit subscribe. If you like the video, make sure you hit like. If you're beginning to plan for retirement and you'd like to get into a conversation on guidance, on planning, and you'd like to learn more about our retirement coaching services, again, there's a link to our website. Just click that and you'll be take into our website and you'll learn how to start a conversation about our services. Anyway, you take care, wishing you all the best in your retirement planning journey.